Hi, I'm back from Tahiti and going to the grocery store. Um, we have no food. I just cleaned out what was left in the refrigerator with things like produce that was, you know, not good anymore and um, cleaned out the pantry of things like bread and things that were, you know, again, getting stale. So now we're headed out to just grab some extra stuff that we need. While we were, we were in Tahiti, it snowed eight inches here. Friends sent me pictures. It was insane. We come back and it's bright green grass and things are blooming. So we missed it. <laughs> kind of the perfect timing. There's always a weather phenomenon of some sort whenever we travel. I don't, it's the weirdest thing. Um, but anyway, yeah, it snowed a lot and it's all gone and uh, we came back to bright green grass and things blooming. I mean, you can't beat that. Let me tell you, it's about 50 degrees right now. I'm not wearing a coat. I'm just sort of wearing this little um, pullover, kind of a half zip with a little bit of fleece inside. So it's perfect for that. We're going to hit the grocery store and the post office. So let's go get your stuff together and jump in. I got my package mailed, thank goodness, because as I was going to the post office, I thought, oh, it's Good Friday. I don't even know if they'd be open, but they are at the moment anyway. So I got my package sent, which was the prize that um, the lovely viewer won from my last um, favorites video, the Peter Thomas Roth um, wrinkle, the unwrinkled peel pads. Got those sent to her. Had to wait till after I came back from vacation to get those sent, but she was very patient and lovely about it. Hi, Jennifer. <laughs> Now I'm stopping at Goodwill to donate a few things I have in the back. I almost forgot about, but then they started rattling around, so now I know that they're there, thank goodness, because I need to get them out of the back of the car before I can put groceries back there. It's donation time. I'm gonna line up here with all these other lovely people. I am using my Target bags from Maui. The Target bags that you get from Maui have the flowers on them, which is so cool. My sister was there, gosh, a little over a year ago. Maybe it was two years. I don't even remember. And she saw these because I have been using these red Target bags, the regular ones, for like years and years and years and years, like 10 years or more. Um, and she knew mine were getting kind of ratty. And she saw these and she knows I love these flowers. So um, she got them and brought them back home for me. I love them and I use them every time I go to Target. Love them. Gorgeous day. There's not a lot in the hearth and hand magnolia section today, although I am seeing some cute stuff. Um, this is weird. These are cheese knives. I don't know. I don't think they'll work very well. I think you need something a little sharper than kind of thick wood to cut cheese, but I could be completely wrong. I have been once or twice before. Um, another thing I'm loving are these little bowls because I have an addiction to little bowls it's like a problem of mine I just think this is cute the way it's just kind of wonky and simple and these plates like those two and then this I'm trying desperately to figure out what to do with this I like it I don't know where I would put it so yeah that's sitting there until I can come up with a thought and then maybe I'll get it but I'm liking that they have um, these little write on place card um, porcelain things. I really think that's really cute. And they have paper place cards here too. Nice. And those are the spoons and forks for appetizers I got a while back and I love them. Okay, leaving Target I have clothing, shoes, a wire basket, a plant, a nice planter. I just got it all my friends. It got it all.
We made it. I'm home, quick Target haul. Because things were strange and unwieldy, it looked like I had more than I really do now that I put it on the table, but here it is, and I'll show you. I got some houseware stuff and things too, so here we go. First food. All right, we have 10 limes. We have a bag of onions. We have three avocados, some romaine lettuce, sugar snap peas, a bag of broccoli florets, green beans, some sliced white mushrooms, some sweet corn. Um, for meat options for a few days, we have some center cut pork chops, which I'm going to pound into make like breaded schnitzel. My hubby's been looking forward to that for a while. Some of these petite sirloin steaks that I get at Target aren't bad. They really aren't bad at all. And for the price, they're really good. So we sometimes get those and I thought they might be good for the grill. I have a bag of blueberry bagels. My husband's favorite spicy nacho Doritos. They are really good, actually. I like them too. Um, Prego traditional sauce with some and some gluten-free penne pasta. Two boxes of these um, Keurig Sumatra pods. So sorry about the focus. Um, I got a package of Toll House semi-sweet uh, chips to make chocolate chip cookies. We have these four large. Uh, chicken breasts that I could make definitely two meals. We do like a half per person around here. They're just so big. Um, and then this mesquite smoked turkey breast. We really like that for sandwiches or whatever, salads. Um, I needed some more popcorn. We do it, I make it the old fashioned way on the stove. So needed more of those. Um, shaved Parmesan cheese. Um, some of these Glad trash bags. I really like them, the ones that uh, have this uh, grips the can, the drawstring that grips the can. I really like those a lot. It really helps. Um, every once in a while I'll use this uh, Cafe Vienna in my coffee to just flavor it up. Um, my new favorite deodorant is the Dove Advanced Care and it is in the bottle with the pear. I like that scent the best. <laughs> and my dermatologist told me to use this so I do because I don't seem to have that natural barrier that other people have apparently on their skin and this helps provide that so I use it and it really helps me a lot. Got some gluten-free um, tortillas. I got a frozen gluten-free California Pizza Kitchen barbecue chicken pizza. I love to get these. This is the pizza ones I get gluten-free when I go to that restaurant. And it's gonna be nice to try that, you know, frozen. They used to have them, I know, but now I haven't seen them in a while and now they're, they've come back. Um, some Italian bread and some 12 grain, whole grain bread. Did I say orange juice? We have orange juice and three packages of Peeps, one for my husband and one for each daughter. That's the Easter treat this year. And then for, I think that's it for food. Um, the non-food items that I got, I got these two rugs because it looked like they might go well in front of the girls' vanities in the bathroom, the new bathroom design thing that we did. I need to try them with the rug that goes in the middle though, so we'll see. So that's another attempt at that. And then I found these, this jammy set, these PJs. Um, they're, it's like a short sleeved, you know, like a top, like your traditional pajama looking kind of a thing. Buttons down, you know, shirt collar, that kind of thing with the shorts. And this brand, it's at Target, but this brand says stars above. Now, I did not see anything that um, any of the Gilligan O'Malley ones that these are just exactly like, but I did see a bunch of things that said stars above. So I thought, well, that's odd. Look who's over there. So I saw these, they look real soft. They remind me of Tahiti. Um, I thought I'd give these a try and I'm gonna look into whether Gilligan O'Malley changed to this or not, I don't know. And from that same um, manufacturer or whatever brand, I got this other little sleep shirt. It's just like a short sleeve t-shirt kind of a thing, but it has this neat little um, knotted bit at the bottom front. And it's just a short sleeved kind of a, um, you know, scoop neck. So got that. I think those will be fun to try. These I thought were really neat. They are a sandal that comes in sizes like small, medium, and large. 
and the medium didn't were too small and the large were too big but I ended up finding a medium large which is an ml and I thought I'd try these okabashi they look very similar to like they're trying to be styled like um, olokai which I have and love um, obviously not nearly as expensive because they are you know plastic where olokai are leather and so forth um, but I love the flower design on the bottom. But I tried them on because it looks like there's a bit of an arch support, and there is a bit of an arch support. So I thought, well, that's kind of neat, and they were soft. It didn't feel like anything was going to rub or pull. I really like that. So I got this bright pink color, which is not like me, but it just seemed right at the moment, and this white color, which I think would go with a lot of things. So comfy just to wear around wherever, running outside of the garden, get in the mail, whatever. Got those. I'll let you know what I think of them. Okay, I was in the magnolia section and got this uh, weekly meal plan. It's like a stack of paper that's a weekly meal plan thing. I thought it was cute. Monday through um, Sunday and an other. There, you have other thing too. And a shopping list down the side. Nice for planning. I thought I'd give that a try. That's really kind of neat. I like it. And I bought an extra one that I will be ending up giving to one of you guys. So look for that sometime. I got this plant because I cannot keep real plants alive. I'm so sorry, Sarah, but I can't. You are the genius. I'm not. Um, so I got this fiddle leaf fig basically, which it looked very realistic considering um, how inexpensive it was. And it comes in this pot with the fake dirt and all. I mean, it really does look nice. Um, I thought that I could find a spot for that for sure. And then I fell in love with this this planter or pot or whatever. I thought this was really cool. I love it. So this will either go outside. It does have a drainage hole thing. It'll either go outside or somewhere in my house for spring and summer. I just love it. And I might even put that, you know, build it up a little on the bottom and put that in here. It looks cute. So there's that also. And last but not least, I got this wire basket with these kind of copper looking handles to put in my office for all of Gracie's toys because her toys are a little out of control in my office right now and we need a place to corral them and a basket she won't chew on. So that is what that is for. So there it is, there's my haul, there's my running around. I appreciate that you guys went with me, it's always fun. Um, super windy out there. I don't know if you about blew away, but I did. Um, and I will see you guys real soon, thanks, bye.